Hi Daigo, I can see you are excited for today's math lesson. Oh, I am. What are we going to do today? We're going to learn about angles and their measurement. Introduction Measuring Angles To measure an angle, we use a protractor. A protractor is a transparent plastic instrument designed to measure angles and an angle is measured in degrees. Measuring Angles Let's measure an angle. Place the midpoint of the protractor on the vertex of the angle. Line up one side of the angle with the zero line of the protractor. We see that the number on the protractor corresponds to 30. So the angle here is 30 degrees. Let's see another example. Place the midpoint of the protractor on the vertex of the angle. Line up one side of the angle with the zero line of the protractor. We see that the number on the protractor corresponds to 135. So the angle here is 135 degrees. Let's see another example. Here, this angle is more than 180 degrees. So we turn the protractor and measure. The number on the protractor corresponds to 45 degrees. To get the angle, we add 180 plus 45 equals 225 degrees. So the angle here is 225 degrees. Wow! Measuring angles is so much fun. I can't wait to work out the exercises now. I'm glad you've understood the process. We move on to the exercises now.